So you know, uh, videos about tree work, seems to me they tend to focus on like the big trees, you know, like taking down the massive cedar. Uh, today's tree job is totally the opposite of that. This might be the smallest tree ever, but uh, it's a little bit complicated. It's actually, as I remember it, I checked it out a couple weeks ago, it's actually like four trees all kind of in one. Real small, none of them probably big enough to climb, but we'll have to see how it goes. All right, so here is your look at the tree. Uh, yeah, we got some mixed stuff going on. There's a honeysuckle in there. And then you've got, you've got like four trees in one. This one is, looking pretty stable you know I think that little piece of 4x4 four four helps out so rot it out here and then this stem back here is actually my strong one so that's gonna be my uh, tie-in point up on top if I can get through the scrabble and then try to get the honeysuckle out you know honeysuckle you cut them and they just kind of don't want to come I was slicing this guy there's also a bunch of obstacles so I don't want to drop and wreck this thing I got a deck here potted plant so drop zone is kind of an exaggeration I'll put some stuff here and I already cut a few branches and I'll put them over here Oh, it's just a little bit rotten. Oh my gosh. So that's the rotten tree. This is the uh, honeysuckle. And then this guy's pretty good. All right, I don't know if you can totally see this, but uh, basically I've gotten above this first canopy. Those are the two lower trees, and then I've got a crotch up here, so I'll tie in to this crotch or the next one, and then uh, it'll allow me to work this area.
That's honeysuckle, man. You cut that stuff, and it doesn't move because it's so ensnared and everything else. Let's start working around the other side. Oh, you know, I guess I could swing over here and get these dudes. Pretty much I just brought the chainsaw to see how much I could abuse it, bang it around. I don't think I've made a single cut with it up here. got away. All right, I got two honeysuckle hung up over there. That's great. All right, this is my rigging line. I'm gonna leave this over here. All right, here's your little update. Uh, up on top of the big boy, the non-rotted tree. And I'm just gonna rig out a couple of these limbs. I'm setting an anchor point uh, down below. I've got just, can you see that? That's no better. Down below, I just have these two stems, both just crushers. You know, one's gonna crush that uh, little enclosed garden thing, and the other's gonna, well, it might fall okay, but Maybe smash a few chairs. So anyway, I'm just gonna set up a rigging line here uh, after I get this branch out. Set up a line, uh, probably to that crotch and somewhere in there, so that when I cut these guys, I can kind of control their fall. Shouldn't be too heavy, I think. Is it? I don't think so. Why do I need to control it? I just drop it right there. I'm not gonna rig that at all. That. I'm just gonna drop it. There's nothing for this thing to fall on. Famous last words. Oh, that was so good. Why rig when you can drop? All right, I'm coming back for this. This is in the future. Oh. Oh. Did I just do that? I think I did.
All right, so here's the situation. Uh, battery died right before I took everything out on this guy. So uh, that happened, battery died, took everything out, got it all cleaned up, and now we've got the final stem. Final stem, gotta climb that guy, you know, a little cut and chuck, drop it down in here, and we should be good. The new drop zone, that's the same as the old drop zone. It's just kind of cleaned out. So yesterday when we were clearing everything out of here, I thought, oh man, I should get all this done in one day. But really nice to come back here the next day and just have clear drop zone, cooler temperature, not all wiped out and just be able to focus on this one stem. I'm just gonna put a sling on here. It's just a little easier sometimes to catch it with yield sling in place. All right, and then I'll just let it tip. I think I'll leave a stub too. I'm gonna need that stub. So I'm gonna leave this stub so that when I Rig the top, I've got something. I might even use that crotch. Looks pretty good. Oh, look at that lovely tree. Completely dead. Oh boy. Oh. Look at this divine crotch up here. It's like the nicest crotch ever. You're really just looking for a good crotch. And that's it. I think that is where I'm gonna stop climbing. And you can see the stem splits. We got this one and this one. And I just need to kind of clean it up first. This guy will be easy. This guy wants to go the wrong direction. So I guess I'll do easy first. That's gonna be good. I'm just gonna handsaw it. It's gonna be like the tree I took down with the handsaw. Kind of holding it right there. Let me ease it down. Okay, where's this guy gonna go? It's gonna go out here. Kind of flopped. Nice, look at that. That's ugly. And this up here. Oh, I can do two stems. Okay. I keep saying I'm not going any higher. I keep going higher. But really, I do need to go a little bit higher. Put some webbing on here. Do a little webinar. Now I know that a lot of people's work just turned into like one big Zoom meeting. And that's kind of awesome in a lot of ways, but dude, I like this. Just being out, you know? All right, this guy's just gonna flop. Same deal, flopper. Okay, I kinda wanna use this sling, so I'm gonna take it off. 
Save a save a sling. Drop zone. See that's filling up. All right, you see what's going on? We got the sling up here. It's gonna come down, go over this crotch. It's a nice crotch. Stub's gonna hold it. I'm gonna hold it. We got like a 50 to one kind of thing going on here. Just need a pretty notch. Am I gonna handsaw this thing? I'm gonna handsaw this thing. Oh, the notch. All right. <laughs> My notch. Oh, I gotta make sure it goes that way. I'm gonna do some pushing. Pushing and a shoving. Going over. That's pretty good. All right, it's just a little crooked over here. So I got a little. Oh, I lost my notch. <laughs> there we go. There we go. That's pretty good. Nice. Okay. I think that's it for the rigging. Rigging line goes bye bye. We go with fairly small pieces just so they're manageable. Okay, don't freak out. Uh, 10 o'clock, Tuesday, first Tuesday of the month. Tornado sirens always go off here. Now, normally I would just like fell this thing, but at this point, but it's got a bunch of lean to it. I'm on the negative lean side right now, so I'm just gonna chunk it. It's small enough I can handle it with my little saw.
All right, so that's a wrap on the uh, four trees in one kind of like package tree deal. And it bears repeating on that job that it's not necessarily how to do it. It's not like a how-to video. It's just how I did it. And uh, it was nice to get it done. So I'm gonna see you in the next project. Hit me with a comment down below if you are so inclined. And have a good one.